Emblem Health has an 80-year legacy of serving New York's communities. Our plan was founded to provide quality care to the people who keep New York running. Today, that legacy still shows through strong partnerships with our labor unions and their families. Every year, we come together to celebrate heroes of labor. These honorees show exceptional dedication to their job, their union, and our city. My name is Aaron Schneider. I'm a sanitation worker, Manhattan 4A garage, mechanical broom operator. To be a sanitation worker, we have um, a lot of different aspects of our job, but we do more than just lift garbage. For example, I work in a broom garage, which is a mechanical broom. Uh, most people know it as a street sweeper. So we do street cleaning, alternate side parking, but we also, we're out at midnight, we're out at from the midnight to eight o'clock shift, we're out, we're cleaning whatever we can, 24 seven operation. So it's not just lifting garbage. We're the same people who plow your streets. We're the same people who drive sand spreaders to clean up oil spills. There's so many aspects of the job that people don't tend to think about as much as picking up garbage. When I put on the uniform for a sanitation worker, uh, there's a sense of pride. My father was a retired supervisor. So it's in my, in my blood, I guess you could say. And to be part of uh, the workforce for New York City is a great feeling. At the end of our shift, we're required to clean our vehicle. And that involves running the elevator in a reverse position. Um, it makes it easier to clean. And the sanitation worker whose arm was caught had his elevator on, but it was jammed so he forgot that the motor was on. So when he climbed up to clean the elevator, it pulled his arm right in. I had, I had heard him screaming and I was the only one that was anywhere within earshot to hear him. So I wasn't really sure what I was hearing, but when I walked over and I saw him stuck, I immediately jumped into the cab of the broom and I shut off the elevator where his arm was caught. To receive a Heroes of Labor Award is an amazing thing. Um, I wouldn't really consider myself a hero. I'm just very happy that I was able to hear my coworker and I was able to react quickly enough that, that he didn't lose his arm, he didn't lose his life. I'd like to thank Emblem Health and I'd like to thank Labor Press for putting on the Heroes of Labor Awards. I'd like to thank uh, Harry Nespoli, president of Local 831, for nominating me. And of course, I'd like to thank my Broom family for just being the amazing people that they are and allowing me to take this award.